Good afternoon and welcome to Nora's Dog Training Company. We are here with Brandy and Bella and we're going to demonstrate all the obedience commands your girls learned here at school. We're going to start off by introducing the training equipment and Brandy's got a standard six foot web training leash and she keeps the bulk of that leash folded neatly in her right hand which leaves her left hand free to make a correction and the only correction we give here at school is a little tug and release on the training collar and that is the second piece of equipment. Now Bella's been fitted with her very own collar. We'll show you how to properly use that and put it on when she goes home on Saturday. Now the first command we're going to demonstrate is healing. Healing is properly walking on the leash, always on your left, and the command is Bella heal. Now Bella doesn't love doing this obedience training. It's great when a dog does love it. She's a little older and kind of a little set in her ways, so she's not crazy about it. So we do try to praise her, reward her for doing a good job, um, but still not crazy about it. But it will be important that you do reinforce these commands when she comes home. So she's just an easier dog to manage. Her barking yeah. is more controllable. And all the other problems that you're having with her are much, much more manageable. Now you notice whenever Brandy stopped, Bella's been trained to automatically sit and wait for that next command. And we like to tell our clients, practice, practice, practice. And you can practice indoors as well as outdoors. Also keep your training sessions relatively short. 10 or 15 minutes is long enough for Bella. Another nice automatic sit. Now the next command we're gonna show you is the sit stay. The sit stay is a hand and a voice command. Brandy will use her left hand, the one word firm command to stay, and then she'll walk out to face Bella. Have Bella hold this sit stay for 30 seconds, working up to three minutes. And you'll notice when Brandy returns back to her dog, she walks all the way around her dog counterclockwise. She stops at heel position. Bella's ready for another command, and they take off healing again. We even tried using treats for Bella to get her a little bit more motivated, but she's not super food motivated when it comes to this training. I know a lot of times, too, with the weather, when it gets warm like this all of a sudden, it does take a lot of the steam out of the dogs when they're not used to it quite yet. We're going to go ahead and show you that sit-stay one more time. Again, have her hold this for 30 seconds up to 3 minutes. Instead of returning back to her, Brandy's going to call her out of that. The command is Bella come. She should come back and she should sit. Bella's added her own little twist to that re recall command or that come command. She comes back and she likes to almost turn completely around and almost sit on your feet. But as long as she's coming when she's called and she's sitting when she gets there, she can kind of do it any way she'd like. Another nice automatic sit. We'll go ahead and show you that recall command one more time. You know, notice Brandy lightens the tone of her voice. You want to make that come command a happy command. Bella comes back and she sits. Now the next set of commands we're going to show you is going to be the down command. And there's two of those. There's down from heel position and there's down from a distance. So when Bella is fully seated, Brandy will use her left hand and the one word firm command to down and to stay. Now dogs will generally hold a down stay longer than a sit stay. So at home you can start off at say two or three minutes, eventually working up to five minutes. And then when Brandy returns back to Bella again, she's going to walk all the way around her counterclockwise. She stops at heel position again and Bella's ready for another command. Or as ready as she will be. Another nice automatic sit, yeah. another nice down command, and a stay. And again, the only time we use Bella's name in training is when you're healing with her, so Bella heal, or when you're calling her, Bella come. The other commands, those other stationary commands, it's just the one word command. Bella heal, a come. She comes back and she sits very nicely. And then the very last command we're going to demonstrate is Bella's ability to lay down from a distance. So Brandy will put her in a sit-stay. She'll take two or three steps away from Bella, and she'll use her right hand and the one word firm command to down. Down. 
Very good, very good. Now Bella's done a really nice job here at school. We're gonna miss her when she goes home on Saturday. So she's learned and she showed you the ability to understand all of the obedience commands, proper leash walking, which is healing, the automatic sit, the down, the stay, the come command, and the distance down command. We want to thank you so much for trusting Nora's Dog Training Company as your personal dog trainer. And I look forward to seeing you guys on Saturday. Have a great day.